No. This is my car. Please go back. You I'm, have no probable cause. I do. You touch What's that fine? bag, you're going to jail. You're my car. I understand. If you don't go back there, I'm going to take you to jail. Y'all are going to jail. <laughs> Forever. Wait, no. My phone, my phone. I'm not resisting. I'm not talking to you. Please get behind your back. Put your... 11 park. It has been a little pervert. Okay, so she caught two felonies and a misdemeanor. Hey! No, no, no. Don't yell. Don't yell. Don't. What's up, everybody? Today we have another entitled Karen getting arrested. So this is what happened. There was an accident. There was no alcohol involved. No one was going to get arrested. But then one of the family members decided to show up on scene smelling like weed and started interfering and turned a non-issue into an arrest for resisting. Without further ado, let's get right into it. Jet 9 reference injuries. Hi there. No injuries. Uh, we have, my mother-in-law is hurt, but she's in oh, okay. there. Charlie 111, I copied old vehicle down the road. How's it going, man? Hey, hey sir. We just need an elderly whiskey box for our check out. Possible hip injury. Okay. Yes. I just gotta clear this out. Would you okay. give me one second, man, okay? Whose car is this? Whose car is this? Come move it. I get that, yeah, we just gotta start clearing it up for well, FD to get here, okay? Do you need me to, can I go? Just put, I were you involved her? at all? No, no, no. No, you can get it out of here, okay? okay? Thank Appreciate you. that, thanks. I'm gonna need everyone's information in a second. Well, what happened? I don't know. That guy's driving, driving and he thought it was a stop stop sign. Sign. Okay. And we both talk at the same time. Yeah. Yeah. Anything else? Any other cars? Yeah, that's Did y'all get hit or no? Yeah, we got hit. He thought there was a four-way stop sign. Okay. Pulled out right in front of us. We okay. three people that stopped. But, I mean, that dude's, I think he's on. I don't know if there's. He's, I don't know. So, uh, you guys keep talking. So he, he's just one of you talking. Yeah. Yeah. So, basically, yeah, right. both of those people that saw it, he, there was a person slowing down. He thought right. there was a stop sign. Zero, he, he shot across the intersection, ran right into us. Okay, obviously coming from Coming here that here. way. Okay. And he's, uh, he seems like a little looped up. Okay. Um, you were driving this car? Yeah. Can you grab your information for yeah, me yeah, and everything? Yeah, yeah, Thank you. You're driving this car? Yes, sir. All right. Is it drivable right now or no? No, nah, you got it. No, once the airbags deploy, you can't drive it. 111 back. Give me one second. Charlie 111, stand by just one. So what happened, man? I thought it was a four-way stop, sir. The yeah. person coming the other direction, they stopped, so I thought it was a four-way yeah, stop, and I pulled out, and I wasn't right. looking that way because I thought okay. it was a four-way stop, sir. I got you. Yeah, okay. You good? Yes, sir. All right, let's check this. Stand for Charlie 111. Drive what you got, sir. Need rotation times two, one for a Toyota Sienna, heavy front end damage, and another for another four door. I'll get the tag in the call in a second. That one. But no injuries or anything like that? I'm good, sir. Okay. Do you have your license and everything yes, on sir. you? Go ahead and grab that for me. Except our yellow shorts. Can I talk to you real quick over here? Yes. So we can all agree that so far no one was going to get arrested. Even though the victim of the crash said that the driver was looped up, he doesn't look drunk and he's extremely cooperative. Now that's where it should have ended if it wasn't for the two daughters inserting themselves in the situation. Let me talk to you over here. Okay, you want to do it in front of everyone. It's the weed in your car. Do you have a medical marijuana card on you? I do. You do? Okay, does anyone else in that car have a medical marijuana card? Because it smells like you're just smoking there. Now, an issue with medical marijuana, you're smoking inside the car, right? Which is a huge issue when it comes to you being impaired. Are you just gonna... I, I know there's a lot going on. I'm trying to prevent another accident. What's that? I was just trying to get the policy number that I didn't know. I'm, I'm just totally separate. I'm dealing with the uh, narcotics in that car. Where's the marijuana in there? Five L24,
I just need to get the policy number. So where is the in this car? It's in the trunk there in my bag. Okay, go ahead. Oh, he's smoking it in the car right now. The pass. Not the pass. It has nothing to yeah, it's totally separate. Get the policy so. number. Is that where it is? Yes. Can you go and grab it for me? Excuse me? What's her name? It's Deputy Wilkinson. What's her name? It's 1014. What's your name? That's for sure. Is there any other man in the car? I do. It's being smoked inside the car. Yeah, no reason. That's I do. Right Where's that? Okay. Where's the man in there? Whoa, hold on. Step, step back, step back. It's in there. Do you, either you one of y'all have people's cars for no reason? You have no problem. I'm telling cars. you, there is a reason. There is no do reason. Do either one of y'all have a medical car? No. No. Okay. Y'all can hang up at that part. Hey, Court. Real quick, I mean, they came up freaking like we in the car. Do you mind just keeping an eye on them real yeah. quick? Yeah, you can't get back in that car right now. I'm telling you, don't don't go back in that car. This is my car. Yes, you phone. Your phone's in her hand. Please go back to the front of there. I'm getting my keys out my car. I'll get it for you. I'm searching it now. This is my car. Please go back. You I'm, have no probable cause. I do. You touch What's that bag, you're going to jail. What's the probable cause? Go back to your car. To I my told car? You, my car. I understand. If you don't go back there, I'm going to take you to jail. You're going to take me. Mom, do you see this shit? Bro, what the fuck is Don't put the hands on me. Yes, mom. Do you see that shit? Your two daughters are acting like complete morons and are making a mountain out of a molehill. It's just a little bit of herbs. It's not a big deal. Go back. Who is you? How about Jimmy Cole? How about that? Oh, I'm on me. 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 i I got Lane, you saw all of you get out of the car? Okay. All right. Y'all are going to jail. Forever. Not talking to you. Put your hands behind your back. All she wanted to resist, she's gonna. If she was resisting, you stand out of the front of your car, you're gonna go too. Watch out, pussy ass trucker. That's a racist ass, pussy ass trucker. Yeah, you want to tighten it. Like I'm, oh, I'm, a, I'm double locking it so it doesn't get tighter. Roll on your side. Yeah, I'm sure you is double locking it, you little pussy. That's for your comfort. That's for your comfort. <laughs> Hold on, I'm not you probably, you probably mad you get no bitches home. Why? 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 Yeah, you do. <laughs> You're mad. Oh, you don't get this people. Okay. Babe, don't let him fuck with you. I want to let him fart. He just being a little pervert. He want right, to fuck with go. Don't you? Don't you, don't you little bitch? Probably a fox trap. What's a fox trap? I hate y'all crushing. Stand up. I'll up my strap. Bend this leg. My big ass strap. 
It's in the back part. Y'all want to search that too? What's this? We'll get we'll get that bill later, baby. Stop. Hey, hey, stop. 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 Hey, stop.
there's two things I observed here. First of all, the tow truck companies in Florida must be making a killing because people are getting arrested a lot. And secondly, this cop really knows how to do his job. He's not negotiating with the criminals. He's not having circular conversations. It's straight up business. This should be a tutorial video on how to handle a difficult traffic stop. <sighs> I'll ask them what they want going to jail, and then we'll be out of here, okay? I don't know where my phone went. Did you give me back my phone? I never took your phone. So, Dude. feel more... What's up? Oh, no, I was oh. going to call it. Feel more than welcome to look in here. Let me know when you're done. This step will be watching you. If you take out anything that I didn't find that is evidence, you're going to go to jail, too. Okay? What you see from mine is right there. Yeah, I, that wasn't medical. I don't want, we can be honest. I don't want to, um, as far as, like, um, just find it. Okay. Now, this is for both of you, okay? Obviously, I have to read these. Sorry, I'm sure you've seen it in the shows before. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say may be used evidence against you. You have the right to talk to an attorney and if him or her with you now or any time during questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, we won't be appointed to represent you. If at any time you wish to stop talking or have an attorney present, all questions will be stopped at your request. Do you understand these rights? With these rights of mine, are you willing to talk to me? You are? Okay. Is that a yes or a no? Because i got to figure out... Yeah. What's that? Yeah. I, you can find out if I say yeah, yes or no. Okay. Whose purse was that? Your purse? Okay, because your ID was in it. No. Okay. Understandable. Okay, understand that... Okay, that's fine. My the girly stuff is hers, the weed is mine. No, it's not. That's why I'm going to ask him. I'll just give him one second. What's up? What? Can you both stop talking right now? First off, why would I do you any favors right now? Okay, you acted like a child. Second, I'm not asking for no favor. I'm trying to tell you what is mine and what is hers. But you, just uh, you both are going to get charged with it. You both are going to get charged with it. I asked her a question, not you. And you're responding. No, I didn't. Okay, so both are going to get charged with, uh, okay, both are going to get charged with possession of marijuana, both going to get charged with possession of oil, which is a felony, you're going to get charged with resisting without violence, you're going to get charged with resisting with violence. You tried to kick me in the car. Yeah, I have on camera. Bye, 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 bye. It will be an easy peasy, man, lemon squeezy. I didn't know. I'm, I'm obliging you right now, okay? I'm throwing it right back now. Would you like your window down too? No, I'm okay. Okay. You want to just sit with them for a little bit? She's getting resisting with violence, felony, possession of oil, which is a felony, possession of Resisting with violence. When I put her in the car, she tried to kick me. Okay. Okay, so she caught two felonies and a misdemeanor. So these are some pretty serious charges. In Florida, the law classifies resisting an officer with violence as a third degree felony with penalties up to five years in prison or five years of probation and a $5,000 fine. Even for defendants with minimal criminal history, jail or prison is a realistic possibility in resisting with violence cases. Also, possession of the oil is a third degree felony, also punishable by a maximum of five years in prison and a $5,000 fine. And she's also facing one year for the class A misdemeanor, which is resisting without violence. So worst case scenario, if the judge was really pissed off and wanted to make an example, she could be facing up to 11 years. Now, is she going to get anywhere close to that of a sentence? I highly doubt it, but it's safe to assume she's going to spend some time behind bars. How much? I don't exactly know, but you guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Now, the video is not over because Karen still has a meltdown in her. One last little outburst of entitlement. The other girl, she's going to catch resisting without violence and possession of which is a felony. What is that? That's a THC vape. In the state of Florida, when it's not flour, when it's oil, it's a felony. She's going to catch that felony. Oh my god. Yep. You know what I would have done if we didn't go this way? Would have put it in for destruction and done a report which would have wasted my time more than yours. So, 
I don't know. Can't fix the actions. I'm no, a very reasonable person. I'm I don't like to. looking at to get, a, get her, one of them out. <laughs> well, with a bondsman, you're probably looking at a few hundred dollars. With cash bond, you're looking at a few thousand dollars. So, resisting with violence, she might need to stay overnight. Let's go to first appearance in the morning. So, but the other girl, she's going to be able to get bonded out today. I prefaced this whole thing with I don't care about the whole thing. Think about that. Here's your stuff. Um, there's an inhaler in that purse that you put back. You can go find her inhaler. And you can take their phones if she wants you to take her purse. I got the phones. You got the phones? Thanks. Go find her inhaler for me. I don't know where it is. Can you go find it? Should be in the black purse is what she was saying. I, just, I don't have my driver's license. Yeah, that's with that oh, deputy right oh, there. Okay, yes, he, he's the one handling the crash. I thought you said they couldn't oh, get yes, the sir. Handling the inhaler. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No it's medical. Uh, and I never said her inhaler. I didn't know about her asthma. No, I, what are you, um, I'm confused what you she want me to do. Go get the inhaler because she has asthma. She's going to jail. She's going to get worked up. And she's asking for it right now. No, I will touch her again, though. We want problems. I think we're glad to. Well, we'll get resistance next time. Hey, what the fuck, bro? I don't understand, but it's... We'll I talk told... later, we'll talk later, don't we? Yeah, I know. I told you not to pull up. <laughs> You, but you seen I was ten feet away. You, like I said, they ain't got this shit on camera. I bet I was ten feet away, and I still got fucked that with. Shit crazy. I was all the way back here. You see how they put? I was all the way back here. Ooh, that one cracker boy. That ooh. babe, like that, like he was that pushing one, me, like I was moving. You, I wasn't you moving. Shit. Ooh, but I ooh. wasn't moving. He got this shit so goddamn tight on my feet. I was talking. Seat, I wasn't moving. Like, they had my hand, they had my I hand. These How am I going to move if you got my hand? That's why he pulled up, little What the fuck? Cracker. Ooh. St. Augustine, bro. Only in St. Augustine. This will never happen nowhere else. Babe, hey, this Flagler, bro. This Flagler County. <laughs> why is Flagler? Bro, this f***ing jungle hut. This right here in Flagler. Uh. We finna go right in fucking Flagler County, bro. <laughs> yup. Shit crazy, though. <laughs> I hate these crackers. This don't feel good. And it's you, hot in here. It's hot. Like, God, I got they do asthma. shit on purpose. I got asthma. Look, man. Look. Pussy. Ooh, Wait, no, I hate this pussy come in here because I got asthma. Hey! No, no, no. Don't yell. Don't yell. Don't yell. No, they need to open up because I'm not finna let nobody know. Hell no. Like, please. I, like, I need air conditioning. And uh, I've never been in this situation, so like. And are you able to turn the AC in? I have asthma and it's kind of hot. I'll roll the windows down for you. You just can't be screaming. I'll I scream because I got your attention. Are you no, allowed I'm, to put the AC no, on? Uh, so this this glass here, it keeps it from going through. So it doesn't matter if it's um, glass and then the ooh, front. But I'll roll the windows down for you guys. I'm really like hot. Man, it's fucking open right here. Stupid ass crackle. I'm really hot. Ooh, I need to get out here, bro. I need to get the fuck away from the city, bro. It take you that long to roll down the windows, my dude? <sighs> this shit crazy, boy. Oof, shit. Oh, yeah, Florida sun. Thank like, the shit gonna feel any better. <laughs> Well, there you have it. Another one bites the dust, another one arrested. Now, it seems like the main Karen is blaming the city, blaming the racist cop, but the one person she should blame is herself. She put herself in that situation and the cop was simply doing his job, but that would require a little bit of critical thinking and we know that Karen is not capable of that. Now, thanks so much for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel. We are on track to hit 100,000 by the summer, and if you could help me out with that, I would truly appreciate it. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.